Okay, let's create the required structures to do paging and sorting and filtering. First of all, we are going to implement paging and sorting. Uh, let's create a folder here. Call it helpers. Okay, first of all, we need a class. Let's call it link data request. Well, we use this class for sending the request to the server and um, for processing the received requests from the client. So what this class would have? A request for paging and sorting, first of all, we need how many uh, rows per page uh, do we need? Let's call it page. And also a field to say how many records should we skip to return the query and let's call it skip. Also, we need to implement a list of fields to use in process of sorting. So uh, before adding that field, we need a data structure, a class to represent the sort request. Let's call it sort. And we need a here to field uh, string field and also string direct. Okay. More than these two fields, we need another member, let's call it to expression. It is a method that will be used to make expression that could be used by the dynamic link library we added here previously in the uh, infrastructure project. So here now we can have a field of by innumerable uh, sort and let's call it sort. Okay, now we need another class to uh, represent the data which should be sent to the client. So uh, let's add a class called link data results. Let's make it public. First of all, we need a property to tell us how many records has been counted totally on the server. Let's call it um, records total. And then if we have filtering condition, uh, how many uh, records has been uh, retrieved after filtering? Let's call it records filter. And finally, and the most important, uh, we need an I enumerable to represent the return data. So let's make this class generic here data and make it generic of T. That's it. Okay, let's go to the uh, repository, I repository async and add another function here. The function we need uh, would take field as link data request and will return a link data result of the type model item. Let's add the usings and that's it. We will implement the repository class at the infrastructure project. To implement the functionality at the repository class, let's first add a, a extension method to iQueryable. So I will add a class, a static class. Uh, let's make it public static. The first thing I should add is a private um, method to do the paging to the iQueryable. Uh, it's very simple. Let's uh, paste it here. You know that you can do it in NC framework. 
you can skip and take and it will make the functionality to a tsql command and it will send it to the sql server and return the results a more tricky function would be a function to do the sorting so we are getting a list of sort items and we will do the sorting using the package we have added earlier system.link.dynamic.core here we should add the using for this it couldn't be uh, added automatically so using uh, system.link.dynamic.core that would do the job okay adding these two private functions let's do the main job i will paste a function here which is the main function it is public and it will do the job just filling the fields of linked data request using these two methods first of all we get the total numbers as we are not filtering yet the filtered records will be equal to the total number we will uh, do the sorting and paging and finally returning the linked data results okay let's do the main job at the repository async class we are hinted here that we have not implemented the class uh, the interface totally so uh, let's click here and we will return here maybe contact that set of of t model and that to link data request of uh, to link data result of uh, request that uh, take request that skip and request that search okay what's the problem with this implementation uh, okay we need async keyword here and that's okay so we have completely implemented what it is required to do paging and sorting functionalities at a server side uh, at the next videos we are going to use uh, the implemented codes at the front end and see uh, how can we use it in action